Roaching Hound Corporation Computing Services presents How to Pet a Doodad The Greyhound Step 1. Pet the Doodad Step 2. Keep petting the Doodad Do not stop Warning Failure to pet the doodad may result in dirty stares and forlorn pacing about until attention is reapplied to her head. Long-term effects cause injury to doodad's feelings. Now, you would not want doodad's feelings hurt, would you? No. Of course not. Step 3. Admire her very very long snout. Note how snouty it is. Wow! I mean just look at it. That is one snouty snout. This adorable tool of hers is often used to take advantage of the hopeless humans when attention or food is required by the doodad. Perhaps we should take another look at the petting in slow motion. Take notes. Notice the demanding stare. It's a look that says, don't stop. Don't ever stop. The tongue escaping its cave. Tongue activity is a sign of pleasure. Or hunger. If hunger, feed doodad peanut butter immediately. Thank you for petting the doodad. And be careful out there. Greyhounds will stop at nothing to get the love they deserve.